Hey there and welcome to Japan Online. Well, today we're going to talk about Playboy and not the Playboy magazine or uh, anything to do with Playboy in America or sex or porn or anything like that. Well, it, it, it's sort of associated with it. We're not talking about that. And yes, you can see some Playboy girls there on, on the pillows and, and maybe a makeup case. But in Japan, the Playboy bunny mark um, you can see one picture there, um, and you'll see a little bit later on the video. Is not actually associated with porn, pornographic material, or the magazine. What you're seeing right there. So you will see this mark on various pieces of clothing, socks, uh, pants, t-shirts, and other clothing, hats maybe. Um, and it won't be anything about porn. You may see kids wearing uh, elementary school kids wearing them on the socks or on a t-shirt, high school kids wearing it on their socks for school um, or parents or you know teenage girls or adult girl, women wearing it uh, on hats or wherever but it's nothing to do with the porn it's just a, a brand you could say uh, just an icon that is uh, that is very popular here and I've asked many kids including elementary school kids including high school kids including university kids uh, do you know what it means and they're just like no it's just a cute little brand the bunny ears the playboy bunny ears but they when you say to them it's actually you know it's 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 a pornographic magazine uh, you know and they're like no it isn't I'm like it is and in fact here in Japan there is the uh, the playboy magazine as well while it's slightly different to say the American one it's still pornographic um, you know most people don't know the original meaning unless you're a guy most likely, uh, to uh, Playboy uh, and the bunny ears. So when you see it here in Japan, you would be like, whoa, why is an elementary school kid wearing it? And they'll be like, well, what's wrong with it? And you're like, well, it's it's a pornographic magazine, you know, brand. And they're like, not here in Japan. Um, but you'll see it and you'll be amazed that, uh, you know, every person, uh, uh, most women will probably have a piece of clothing. Um, of course, not old people, but, uh, you know, the hip kind of people. So it was very, very interesting to sort of see people wearing that uh, and not knowing what it means. But anyway, thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, click on the big red button there and you'll be able to receive updates when we post uh, our videos online. To the left there, you have a couple of videos. Uh, the top one there is uh, Japanese festival music and some of the interest instru instruments that they use. Below there we have uh, the randosaru, which is a, a school bag that uh, elementary school kids uh, wear to school use to, to for their school bag in Japanese schools. So click on those uh, those links there, and you'll be taken to the the videos directly. And if you haven't already, look, check us out on Facebook, uh, the Japan Online channel, and we post many videos, photos, events, information about life here in Japan. Anyway, thanks for watching. Later.